For me, session two was particularly powerful. As a Christian for most of my life, I knew the truth. I knew that as a believer, I shouldn't be sinning. But each time I did sin, I was giving sin even greater influence in my life. So I was locked in this vicious cycle of sin, shame, and remorse, then confession, forgiveness, and a renewed determination to live right, only to fall back into sin when I was feeling weak or vulnerable, repeating the whole process over again. Just before coming to see Paul at Provision House, that cycle in my life was getting shorter and shorter, and I was putting at risk everything I held dear. Essentially, I was gambling with my marriage, my family, and even my relationship with the Lord. But as Paul walked me through the scripture, he presented Romans chapter 6 to me in a completely new light. It was as if for the first time my ears were open and I truly understood the powerful truth of Romans chapter 6 verse 7. For he who has died to sin is freed from sin. I still get excited when I remember truly understanding this revelation for the first time. I sat in Paul's office and cried tears of joy as I realized that I was not doomed to repeat this cycle again and again, that when I died with Christ and was baptized into his death and resurrection, that I also died to sin and rose to a new life. James chapter 5, 16 says, Confess your trespasses to one another and pray for one another that you may be healed. I have no problem admitting to others that I was a slave to sin, but by his stripes I have been healed. And I realized that I simply needed to know and believe that truth that Christ died to sin once for all, and since I have been united with him in the likeness of his death and resurrection, that I too am free from sin. I used to think there was some additional experience that I needed to go through in order to be free from sin. But through this biblical teaching, I finally realized that the only experience necessary occurred 2,000 years ago on the cross, and that the only way I could enter into that experience was by faith. <music>